Hey guys, so if I die today, it'll be at least, you know, My buried. Ba- well, it'll be his bad, totally. <laughs> but I'll be buried in hockey carts. <laughs> Holy <laughs> mackerel. Look at this. I'm, I'm here with uh, Klutz and Chara. Now, now you're screwing me up because I was thinking about the pronunciation. <laughs> Klutz and Chara. How do you get this stuff? Uh, it's called OCD, obsessive compulsive disorder. Okay. So when you open an insane amount of a product, you get an insane amount of cards. We have a problem, but it works. What's the most valuable card in this box that you can think of? There's, there's better stuff in the trunk. Uh, it's the, the MTO. There's a made-to-order card in there. It's, it sounded crunchy. Made-to-order? Six players. You can get a game-use piece of any six players you choose that on that card. You choose? You pick. It can be George Vesna, Peli Lindbergh, Matt Sundin, whoever you want, you can put on that card. <laughs> and, and you're saying, wait, you have this? We have this. <laughs> what does it look like? It's got six white heads on it. It's number to three, but it's called made to order. And you can pick any six players you want and put it on that card, and it will come with a game used piece. Who are you, who are you thinking of putting on it? We're thinking of selling it. Cause we a blank. Can, blank. Uh, that, You're giving them a blank check. Be, exactly. <laughs> we can't come to a consensus on who we want, so let someone I'll who really wants it. Pick what they want. I'm gonna pull a card out at random. Oh, all right. One That's of one. one of one. So this is the only card of its kind in the world. Um, well, no, there's more in the in the Brotherly Love series. Yeah. Yes. But this card, you won't find another card um, like it. Keith and Wayne Primo. <laughs> there's a connection right there. Um, <laughs> a double double color. Um, Look at me trying to use card collecting terms like I did in first year of university. Um, talking about, right? It looks like Keith Flyers, Wayne. I'd be guessing, but I'm gonna say Sabers. <laughs> I'm gonna say Sabers. Uh, oh, Sabers! Ah, Clutch. Awesome. You ever talk to the hockey card show? Which hockey card show? No, they're Rock called card. the Hockey Card Show Never. on uh, Twitter. They're good. They they they'll like crack a pack and they'll make like a you know. Like talk about stories and stuff on the way. You guys would be perfect friends. We would get along very well, I imagine. One last question. What's the, what's the most expensive pack you've ever cracked? 0506 Upper Deck The Cup. The okay. one we were just telling you about. At the time, it cost us $800. <laughs> but we pulled the Sidney Crosby Cup Auto Rookie Patch, three colors gold, number 53 of 87. Sold it for four thousand dollars. Is that, that the most expensive card you've ever sold? Four thousand? Yes. Over nine thousand. The most expensive card I've ever sold? Sixty dollars. Was that your stamp poster on the distributor? Hell no! I still have that card. You Are you kidding? Uh, it was a Mark Savard one of one uh, plate. Oh, and I I had two Ovechkin rookies at one point, and in his se- second year, sophomore year, when he dropped to ninety points, I sold it. I did. Look at him. Dude. I knew I was making a bad decision when I did it. Lucichar.com, Steve Dangle.